Hi guys, it's Marissa and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm just going to be doing a haul of some stuff I've bought while being quarantined <laughs> and stuck into my apartment. Not literally stuck, but you know what I mean. Um, so I've been shopping a lot online, but I'm taking a break now because I kind of went like a little overboard with like Amazon and all the makeup I bought. Um, I am having a mimosa, so cheers if you are drinking something. That's supposed to be a clink noise, like clink. Have you guys seen, speaking of, have you guys seen that video of that guy and he's like in a mirror and he's like, cling cling, ching ching, ching ching, ching ching, and it's like four mirrors. Anyway, it's funny. Um, yeah, so I am just going to show you guys, um, I'm just going to show you guys some stuff. No, I won't. Um, so yeah, let me just get started. I'm also going to include some stuff I was sent in PR from Estate Cosmetics. I do have a code with them if you want to give them a try. Um, this is a mixture of makeup and um, um, skincare products, just to let you know. Wait, I'm going to start with Ulta. So, um, this is primarily skincare. I got these Skin Iceland Ice Patches. Um, I bought a pair of these at like Marshalls or something and it was like a, a pack of four and I was obsessed with them. I have really really dry under eyes um, and like a lot of fine lines under my eyes so I just feel like these um, they just make your skin f feel so moist under here. It's a hydro cool firming eye gel um, and I definitely think that they really definitely work based off the ones I got at uh, Marshalls. It was either Marshalls, TJ Maxx, one of those stores, you know? Um, I also got some Bliss products. So I got two masks. One was the Mint Chip Mania. Um, this came highly recommended from my friend Mackenzie. The cooling and soothing ice cream textured mask. So I'm actually going to try this one tonight. If you follow me on Instagram, you will see this on my Insta story. So I'm going to try it. Um, it's Super Cooling Whip Mask. It's Ultra Ultra Mint. Aloe vera rich formula, hydrates, shea butter, chocolate chip pieces, leave skin smooth and nourished. So I am super excited to try this. Another mask I got was the Mighty Marshmallow. This is the Bright and Radiant Whipped Mask. This also came recommended from my friend Mackenzie. Um, so this one is Brightening Boost. Marshmallow root extract. Um, it has antioxidants, vitamin C, olive leaf extract, and lemon oil. So that sounds yum. Oh wow, it looks so fluffy. Oh, I'm so excited for this one. Oh, it smells so yum. I purchased the Bliss Sugar Lip Scrub. Um, my lips have been so dry. I haven't really been keeping the best care of my lips, um, to be honest. Like I, I just, I just haven't been. So um, yeah, I just need a scrub because they're so dry and like chapped. So that's super cute. I these are actually my first Bliss products. Years ago, I used to use one of their cellulite creams, but I haven't used Bliss like since then. But because Mackenzie were. Um, recommended it. I decided to get it. Anyway, I purchased the the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Um, I used to be obsessed with this. This is my ride or die. But then after I use a product for like a really long time, I like to just like just test other things, and then I just become obsessed with something else. So then I just stop using the thing. But I always think about this just because this used to be like my my go-to. So, I so this next shipment is from Dulcuda, Dulcuda, I think, Cosmetics. Um, what led me there was that I actually was looking for a green, a bright green pigment for this look that I want to do. But I actually don't even think this is the color I need. I think I should have got the yellow instead. But whatever, I'll still use this green pigment. They have a bunch of pigments, like neon pigments. Um, and then while I was there, because like that was like they were having this huge sale, so that was only like four dollars. So 
So I was like, I might as well pick up some lashes. So I picked up some of their lashes. This is an Aquarius Bambi Mimi. Super cute. I This is my first time trying their brand. Um, I've like put on like Insta stories like, oh, does anybody know any like neon pigments? And this is one of the brands that um, was recommended to me. Drink break. Um, yeah, so that's why I uh, I got this. What do you guys think about all this crazy Corona stuff? Isn't it like scary? I live in New York, um, Brooklyn to be exact. Um, and yeah, it's insane here. I like can't. I yeah, I don't even I don't even know what to say. It is like so scary how the numbers are increasing, but please stay inside. Even if you're not in New York, if you're in somewhere else, like it's best that we just all stay inside so that it doesn't get as bad. If you're like in a different place that doesn't, you know, just stay inside, flatten the curve. I'm sure you guys have heard that saying, stay home. Um, only go out if you need to like go to the grocery store. It's crazy because I can't even get groceries delivered anymore. So, so yeah, stay inside. So this is a shipment from Sephora. So I got the new Huda Beauty. This is uh, the pastels. I got the lilac one. There's also a um, pastel green one as well. Look how pretty that is. Super pretty. You see those colors? And I've been really into like purple looks lately, so I got another one of these Urban Decay Heavy, heavy Metal Glitter Lighters. This isn't anything new, um, but I got the purple. Is it focusing? Um, I got the purple, which is super pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but super pretty. And then this I might return. I'm just trying to find, like I said, I was try I'm trying to do like this specific look I was just trying to find things that like match like the color I'm trying to go for so this is Ur also Urban Decay it's a glide on eye pencil hmm, that actually might be more like the color I'm going for um, it's just like an electric green or yellow I guess um, again it's just because of a look I'm trying to do so <clears throat> and then I have not used this in years I stopped using Too Faced so long ago when something like turns me off from a brand, it takes me a long time to get like back into the brand. I don't know if anybody else out there is like that, but I can't remember what happened with Tooth Fakes that I just was like, ew. Yeah, I can't remember what it was, but I got their lip injection thing again, because I used to love this. This makes, actually I'm gonna put it on now. This makes your lips so plump, in my opinion. I mean, it doesn't last long, of course, but it goes on so, it doesn't feel like a gloss. It feels like a like a juicy chapstick. I don't even know if that makes sense, but that's what it feels like. Um, yeah, so this is the um, lip injection extreme one. Ninety three percent said looks look lips look fuller and more plump. Ninety seven percent said delivers instant results, and ninety seven said percent said lips feel moisturized. And it does tingle, but like it's not uncomfortable or anything. So next I got some stuff from Beautylish. Um, I love Beautylish because it lets you divide the payment into four, which I find so convenient, especially if you're trying to buy like a lot. I have been dying for this. This is the Natasha Denona. This is the Metro Metropolis, Metropolis, Metropolis. Metro I, I mispronounce things, so I might be mispronouncing it. I don't know. I don't know how to talk half the time. Um, Metropolis palette. I've been dying for one of these, but I've always like not pulled the plug because this palette is like a hundred and, and something dollars. Yes, I, I did spend a hundred dollars on a palette. But look at this. And like they're so cream I I can't. They're so like creamy and like look how pigmented those are. Do you see that pigment? Wow. Like Oh, um, I got the Kappa Copacana Bronze Glow Oil from um, Sol Junero. I like cannot pronounce anything. I sound so stupid. 
Mmm, smells like, it smells like um, tropical leaf. So it comes with like this little pumpy pump. And you just, um, oh, you can even put on your face. It says you can put for body or for face as a highlighter or mix it with your foundation. Well, I'm definitely going to do that. Okay, so let me make sure my um, boobs don't pop out. Can you see them? Okay, just making sure you can't. And then I'm just going to do one pump at first. I mean, my skin definitely feels soft. Um, oh, yeah, it definitely gives you a glow. It's so soft wow does it look like glowy look at my shoulders Ooh. Mm. do i look like super dude and then i don't know if you guys well if you don't know but if you follow me on instagram you know that i destroyed this palette and i was so upset because this palette is limited edition and then they came out with it again because i dropped it on the ground and i was so upset um, like so upset. So this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills and Nicole Guerrero. Oh, so pretty. Oh my gosh, I can't even. I'm not using this for a very long time. I should have bought two so I could save one. If it's still online, I might get another one. This might be like my favorite palette, highlighter palette, excuse me. Highlighters in general, like this. It looks on every skin tone. Oh, it's just so good. So I got that, that, oh, and then I got my favorite lipstick from, um, from ABH, which is the shade Latte. I, um, lost it in December, so I've been, like, fiending for it. Okay, so, the day that I was filming this haul, um, my roommate started to move out, and so it was, like, a lot of commotion and noise, and so it was impossible to film because, yeah, she obviously was, like, moving boxes and furniture and stuff. Um, so I'm going to continue on to this haul now that I just, it's been so busy with like work and life that I haven't been able to. Um, my job is still making us go into work. Um, I'm not, I don't work for, <laughs> I don't work for a doctor. I, I'm not a nurse. I, I literally have a normal job and I, yes, but I'm think I don't want to complain because I'm thankful that I still have a job. A lot of people in my company were furloughed. So anyway. That's why I haven't had time to finish filming this because I've just been so busy with work. I purchased some products from this company called Anise, and they're basically products for your butt. <laughs> I know that sounds kind of weird. So I picked up um, three of their products. I got a mask, a scrub, and an oil. So you're supposed to start off with the, that booty though. This is a walnut shell booty scrub. Um, and then on to the down with the thickest, which is the collagen booty mask, which is what I just showed you. And then last but not least, I got an oil. And this one is, have you seen my underwear? It's a caffeinated booty oil for soft, perky, moisturized booty. It's what it says on the bottle. So basically this is supposed to help um, with cellulite, with the smoothness of your butt, uh, making sure, yeah, your butt's like soft, supple. Um, if you have like bun bumps and stuff, I saw a lot of the before and after pictures, it helps with that too. Um, so I went ahead and got that. I discovered the brand because I was just bored one day on Revolve. I didn't buy these from Revolve, but um, I was bored one day on Revolve and I saw the, like, it's like a booty mask. What's that? And so yeah, I wanted to give them a try. Um, I think it'd be kind of weird to do like before and after pictures, <laughs> um, but I'll definitely, if you follow my Instagram, I'll definitely, um, let you guys know my progress and like how I'm liking it so far. And then last but not least, this is the final product, um, affiliated with Estate Cosmetics. Uh, any of the products I'm about to show you, you could um, order and I'll put the link down below if you want to check them out. I got two of their... Um, lip icing, which I love. The shade here is Drenched. It's like a purple metallic icy shade. And then this is Splash. Ooh, this is the blue. That's really pretty. This is Splash. Um, so yes. And then we have two, we have a highlight powder. I'm really excited about this. Their packaging is super cute. Um, but this is a highlight powder and it's purpley. 
The purple one is Afterglow. This one is Raindrop. It's a blue color. Yeah, I think I'll be use those as eyeshadows. Um, unless I do like a cool look that like calls for um, like a cool color highlight. So that is it. Um, that is everything I got. I'll do another one of these videos for the Sephora VIB sale. Um, there's tons of stuff I got there or I'm going to buy. I haven't bought it yet, but I'll do another like haul type video for that. Really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, have a great day. Stay safe out there, you guys. Bye guys.